Hello everybody, this is Bella's Dad aka Phil. Coming back at you with another box of halves. As you saw the one yesterday, lots of proofs, lots of silver, great stuff. This is the sister box right there and you have a proof ender and a silver ender. Let's see what this box holds for us. Hopefully it beats the last one. We'll find out. And so it begins. Roll number one. That's a proof. You can see the glare. 1985. Let's keep it going. All right. As you can see, we are five rolls in. Big bag of nothing so far. So just that one proof that we've gotten so far out of the first five rolls. Hopefully the next ones will look better. Roll number seven. We have what looks to be a triple scoop, as my daughter would say. Three finds in there, so let's take a look and see what we got. As you can see, there's another proof. A 78. Beautiful looking proof. Throw that in the pile. We go down... To here, that's definitely silver. 90%er. I think I saw one more. I did. A 67. A 40, a 90, and a proof. Nice roll. Let's see what the next ones hold for us. Roll number 10. We got another proof. Another gorgeous 79. Happens to be my birth year, so I like it. We'll keep it going. And we're on roll number 11. It's hard to tell, but that one looks silver right there. It's this one. Sure is. 1968. So we got another 40 percenter in the books. We'll be back with the next one. All right, nothing left in those rolls on that set, so 15 rolls down. Nothing since roll 11, so let's see if we can get lucky with some more. And we're back on number 16. Uh, if you can see it, there we go, it's focused. That's definitely silver. Let's see what we got here. Oh, this one. Really nice looking 67. Back with the next one. Nothing else through roll 20. Let's see what 21 brings us. I tell you, I was about to get upset. 21 through 25 had nothing. And then I go through this roll. Last one, 25, and that one right there just it looks silver. So I'm hoping that we don't have a full skunk set. Hey, it is silver. 69 Denver. We got another 40 percenter on the board. That's halfway through the box. Three proofs, four 40s, and a 90 percenter. Not bad. All right, we got number 26. As you can see, it looks like we got a pair of proofs in there again. There it is. 1978 a couple of small scratches on there but extremely clean coins look at these things almost perfect and a 79 not bad for that roll let's see if we can keep the streak going all right we are on roll number 26 7 28 Let's see if you can see it. We got one proof for sure there. And it looks like we got a silver here. So we have a double bubble, as my daughter would say. Oh, that proof's got a nasty scuff on it. But it's another 79 for the books. Where is it? I saw it down here. There it is. Ooh, 90. 90, 90. One more for the 90 club. 
This is a darn good box. Let's see where it ends up. And we're on roll number 30. And I know you can see it. Oh, yeah. What is it? 64. Another 90 for the books. Nice. All right. Roll number 31. Potential for a couple of proofs in there. So there's the first one, a 1985. Nope, just the one. Still, another good find. On to the next one. Alright, you can see we're on roll number 35 right now. Here is the roll. There's got to be at least two proofs. Maybe the third one in there. Unreal, these rolls. Another 1985. No, nope, not a proof, just a wide rim. And another 1985. And that's it for that one. Off to the next one. Alright, roll number 37. Definitely another proof. I swear this must have been a coin shop that broke a bunch of sets. 1979. That's the only thing I can think of that would have this many like that. Stay tuned for the next one. And roll number 42. Looks like another proof there. Another gorgeous 1979. It's crazy how many of those there are. Let's see what we find next. And we're back with roll number 43. And I'll tell you what. It looks like another proof. Sure as crap is. Look at that. Another 85. Is this one silver? No. Looks like that's it for that roll. On to the next one. Alright, roll number 44. Let's take a look. Definitely a pro. Ooh, I didn't see that. That looks silver. Double bubble. Do we have a double bubble? Let's see. Ooh, yep, that's definitely a 79 proof. No arguments there. Um, put that there. Down right there. Hey, 40%er. No complaints there. More silver on the board. On to the next one. We're on roll number 45. That's definitely silver. Yep, 1968 Denver. Another 40%er. I don't think there's anything else. This way. Nope. On to number... What is that? 46. Alright. 46 and 7 didn't have anything. 48. Can you guess? I think it's kind of obvious. Again. It's almost like which proof is it going to be? 79 or an 85? On to the last two. These two are guaranteed to have something. One has a silver ender. One has a proof. Let's see what they show us. Alright. Roll number 48. Sorry, 49. There's the ender. Hey, and it's a 78. It's not a 79. We switched it up at the end. Go figure. I don't see anything else in that roll. I'll check on it real quick, and then we'll be back with the last one. All right, and the last roll of the box, there's the ender. A dirty 64, so at least it's a 90%er to finish it off. 
I see nothing else in that roll, so let's do a quick wrap up here. You got four 90 percenters, six 40s, and three, six, nine, 12, 15 proofs. Not a bad match to the sister box that we had from the last video. I think we had 22 proofs from the last one and then 15 here. And then all the silver from the last... Oh my god. It's amazing. Amazing. If you guys didn't see that, check out the last video. Guys, thank you for watching. It was, it was an amazing, amazing trip doing this box. I hope I have more to show you guys like this. Of course, everybody wants boxes like these. So happy hunting, good luck, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe if you are not subscribed because there will be more coming out. Thank you and have a great day.